Hey everyone, what's up? It is very early here. <laughs> it's like six o'clock in the morning. So you are getting me um, with my fresh <laughs> morning face. Um, I'm coming to talk with you because yesterday I didn't get a chance to do my confession um, and shit hit the fan for me yesterday and I wanted to share and I wanted to talk with you about it. So, and I'm doing it so early because I'm watching one of my best friends, um, her daughter, she's two, and um, while it's so much fun, any of you with children know, there's no way I can get a live stream in with her <laughs> and like know what I'm talking about. Hi, Erica. Um, and so, the shit hit the fan yesterday. Okay, so my day seven confession is my life is anything but glitz and glamour. And I think that on, I think that online, like they just, and everybody who like runs a business, like love to make their like lives look so much better than what they actually are. Like they have the most, they, you know, they have the, the beautiful houses and the granite countertops and they have all of this stuff. And they have these, you know, really cool pimped out rides and they have like big, big diamonds on their hands. And, you know, they're always doing all these things. And I think that, the people who are really doing that, I think that's wonderful. There's no shame in that. But I'm gonna tell you something. Being just a regular business owner is not all glitz and glamour. If you're just a regular business owner, you're doing the work, right? You're doing the work, you're, it's a daily grind, it's day in and day out, and it's not good looking. <laughs> it's not, you know, it's up early, you know, staying up late, and it's working your ass off. and. You know, for a long time I got caught up in like trying to make my brand look all like glitz and glamoury and beautiful and stuff like that. Thanks, babe. But you know what? I'm not, I'm not doing that anymore and I don't care. Like I don't, it doesn't mean anything. It, it's showing, pretending like my life is glitz and glamour is complete bullshit. I pretty much live on a farm. We have chickens, I have two dogs. Um, that's my like mini farm and I'm like really proud of that and um, I'm not trying to be all glitz and glammy okay so just to give you guys that like confession is my life is not that I traveled like last month I mean last year I traveled almost every single month um, and it was great but it's not my life all the time and I'm totally fine with that and so how why I'm telling you this is reflect onto your life and if you are running a business and your life isn't com like glitz and glamour and it's not, you know, traveling all the time and it's not you looking beautiful and perfect all the time, look at me. <laughs> no makeup on, I'm just here doing my lives. It's okay because that's like what normal business people's lives look like, okay? Now for day eight, let me talk to you about today. I want to talk to you about last night and how shit really hit the fan. So... I was doing um, this training, you might have seen me talk about it, it's called Launch Like a Witch. It's, la it's launching your business, launching a service like a witch with my friend, her name is Lisa Vaz. And if, if Murphy's, like Murphy's Law of if what can go wrong, will go wrong, happened last night. And But it's a really good learning lesson and I want to talk to you about it because we had prepped all day long, all day. All day, all day, all day. You should just see like the preparation that went into this free training, okay? And it fucking failed. <laughs> we could not, we could not get like, we couldn't go live to save our lives. Every, both of our live streams kept getting interrupted, kept pausing. She couldn't come on to mine and I couldn't go on to hers. It was crazy. It was the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life. And like it was pausing and Lisa's Facebook app like deleted her from it. It was crazy, like shit that like never happens. And so we couldn't go live, like we couldn't give this training. And it is a big deal because we have been promoting it for well over a week. We've been prepping for well over two weeks and it was a really big deal that we couldn't go live but here's here's what I want to teach you so we didn't panic we ended up laughing about it and we found a solution very quickly 
And that's what's gonna, that's like, that's what real business ownership is, is it's not gonna go perfect hardly ever, ever. And that's annoying <laughs> and it's stressful. I was, you know, we were both pretty stressed out, but it was like, well, we could either cry or we could laugh and I'm gonna go with laughing because there's nothing else that we can do at this point. And so that's what we did. And so the point of this is shit's gonna go wrong in your business. And you can put a thousand hours into prep. It might not even matter. I think that the moral of the story is don't prep your ass off with things. Sometimes it's better to fly by the seat of your pants and just kind of go with what's, you know, what it is you want to talk about and be prepared. If, if it doesn't work, to have, always have a plan B and a plan C, like if you can, you know, and and the good thing is, is like our followers are amazing and they're like all going to come back and we're going to do Zoom tomorrow or today. We're going to do like a Zoom call. So like hopefully that will go through instead of just Facebook Live. But let me tell you, it's fucking stressful, stressful. And um, it wasn't fun, but we learned so much. And um, I just want to reflect that. Hey, Michelle, I just want to reflect that back onto you. And just let you know that things are not going to always go easy. They are probably going to fuck up a lot. And they're not going to go smooth, especially when you own a business and you run a business. Um, but that's real entrepreneurship. That's real. That's real. That's what it's like to own a business. And the best part is for you to just smoothly figure out a solution to your problem. Very simple. Just... Don't panic and find the fucking solution. And the, the qu more quickly that you can do that, okay, the more success you're going to find. But the more time you spend panicking and the more time you spend all up in arms and freaking out about things, you are going, it's not going to be good, okay? So those are, that's my day seven and my day eight. Go back and watch a replay. Talk about day seven, which is, my life has anything but glitz and glamour. And day eight, how last night shit hit the fan for me and Lisa. And that that's real entrepreneurship. And if you haven't had to deal with that yet, brace yourself. It took me two years. Two years of grinding to deal with something like that. It was complete chaos. But it was fun. And it's going to be okay. It's not the end of the world. Okay? I hope you guys have a great day. Um... Again, I'm always here if you guys need anything. I have a lot more days left. We're going up to day 20. I'm on day 8. Um, and I will talk to you soon, okay? Bye.